We have seen people doing $10,000 with the Aptos airdrop. Let me guide you through this video with a new potential airdrop of ZK Sync and all the ecosystem that goes behind the ZK Sync rollups. But first of all, let me walk you through ZK Sync. ZK Sync is a layer 2 solution that has the goal to speed Ethereum transaction, scale Ethereum, and make gas transaction much lower. All of that while maintaining the security and the privacy for its users, thanks to the use of the zero knowledge proof, which means that the transactions are executed off chain on a second layer, but then they are put together in a sort of a bundle and the, the final transaction is done on the first layer, which is Ethereum. So you have the security of Ethereum with the rapidity of the second layer. The core advantage of the ZK or Zero Knowledge Rollups is the fact that they provide a cryptographic proof without the need for sharing information. This increases the privacy. So, for example, people can approve a transaction without knowing how many tokens have been moved from one hand to the other, but just knowing that the transaction is valid. Another big advantage of ZK Sync is that they rely on math instead of validators. There are also validators on ZK Sync, but they play a different role. They are known as operators and they are in charge for executing and aggregating the transactions and also for submitting them to the network. But they do not validate their transactions. ZK Sync ensures a truly decentralized and secure environment for developers that they want to deploy smart contracts on the network, they want to have low gas fees, they want to have high scalability and really easy and seamless execution. This opens the door for DeFi applications, for new dApps and for new improvements. There are already hundreds of projects on the ZK Sync ecosystem. Notable ones are Uniswap, Aave, Balancer, Lynch, one inch, chain link, and so on. Another element of ZK Sync is called Layer 3, which has not been announced officially, but in the community, in the ecosystem, there is a big speculation that this is going to happen one day. So the Layer 3 solution will mean that a token, ZKS, will be created. This will represent like an ecosystem within the Layer 2 solution. So it will even create more dApps and a new ecosystem. Now, in order to get the airdrop, the thing you can do and you should do is to create as much activity as you can, especially on the testnet. First of all, let's add the ZK Sync Layer 2 solution, the testnet version, to our MetaMask and I'm going to show you how to do it. So you can go to chainlist.org and connect your wallet and then sign the transaction. In that way, you're going to add in your MetaMask the network of ZK Sync testnet. Once you have it, you can go directly to the website of ZK Sync 2.0 and create and ask for a faucet. A faucet is a testnet token that is going to be generated by the network. This will require you to have a Twitter account that is already available. Another protocol you should use is Orbiter Finance. This is a decentralized crossroads up to layer two bridge that helps you to bridge across several blockchains. You can send from Ethereum, BNB and so on. And this is a, a protocol that you should use. Another thing you can do is to trade on ZigZag. This is an exchange, a decentralized exchange where you can really move tokens around in the ZK Sync ecosystem. And on top of that, you can download the wallet Argent which allows you also to interact with ZK Sync. After that, you can go to the NFT market called Mint Square, which is based on the ZK Sync ecosystem. You select the ZK Sync testnet and you mint an NFT. You just need a JPEG and you can mint it directly on this market. And then it's up to you. I mean, you can also look around. There are so many platforms, so many apps and dApps that you can really, you should try as much as you can, especially the ones that they don't have a token yet. Finally, you can donate on Jitcoin. This is another aspect that is, has been very important for Optimism as well, uh, for the bigger drop that they did. So if you donate on this app, on this protocol, Gitcoin, and you donate on ZK Sync, you can participate to this airdrop token. I hope this video helped you and see you in the next episode of Zurich Crypto Journal.